Hello fam, how y'all doing? It's your Uncle Tim. This is Uncle Tim Rants and Reviews, the channel where I read and I review. Fam, you know, people ask me what do I like most about the collecting community? The camaraderie. People explaining to you how they set their stuff up, you know, how they get deals, um, the secrets to, you know, what they do. You know what, and I'm gonna tell you something. A lot of people make it seem like if you tell people stuff, it'll mess it up for you. But I'm gonna tell you something. When you in a whole nother state, whole nother damn country, shit don't really matter. Now, I see if all 8,000 of you was in the same damn state. Yeah, it might would be a problem. But you know how many people in a state? So you see where I'm going with this, right? Or if all, put it like this, if everybody, 18,000 people that was on this channel, that's on this channel right now, for our subscribers, were in Chicago, and everybody wanted to pick up toys. Yeah, it might be a problem. But you know what? There's almost 100 targets in Chicago alone and surrounding suburbs in Illinois. You're bound to be okay. But see, that's the thing that we look at, fam. You know, I enjoy the camaraderie. I enjoy starting the Facebook group because it lets people who don't get opportunity to get out all the time see what's hitting the shelves and what's out there and what the prices look like. And, you know, what deals are coming in, what they can find at certain stores. Man, it's an amazing situation when you don't have to do all the legwork to actually look for everything. You know, I know a lot of you all don't have social media. I get it. But you know what? I like this. You know, I like, you know, seeing what people are getting. I like looking at people's collections. I like telling them, man, great job, fam. It looks amazing. And most of the time, they all look amazing. If they don't look amazing, they look awesome or stellar or whatever but i'm happy to be a part of the community you know there's a few toxic people in the community just like with anything fam you know what people don't understand there's a sewing community there's a handgun community um there's a funko pop community small electronics community a video game action figures die cast car community a hot wheel only community uh gym shoe community um, basket weaving community. Um, I know you're saying, but uh, that's just the sewing community. No, it's not. Each thing is a different um, lane. Sewing could be like you sewing your shirts and putting buttons on stuff. That could be sewing too. And you know what? There's a vending machine, vending machine community. Man, so there are so many different things, trial halls and everything on YouTube. There's so many different damn lanes. I don't get how everybody make it seem like just staying in your lane ain't good enough. Man, staying in your lane is a fantastic thing, fam. It's an amazing situation. It's something that I can get behind wholeheartedly and tell people that, you know, being a member of this community and seeing the good in people and seeing the bad in people, I'm okay with that. But I'm happy that there's some good and, you know, people are sitting back talking about certain things, how they feeling about stuff. You know, the way how stuff is making them feel, you know, how everyday life is affecting them as collectors, you know, how it's hitting their pockets, you know, the disposable income is shrinking. But with these prices that we are being offered at um, Walmart, Target, um, Ross, Burlington, Marshall, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, GameStop, you know, in these clearance areas, you know, a lot of us are racking up. Especially, you know, in situations where a lot of our pockets have shrank. So this is a good thing. You know, a lot of people don't understand that. They just want to get mad and angry and feel some kind of way about it. But you know what? You can't be like that. Sometimes this situation is what you make it. You know, being a collector is not oohs and ahs all the time. You may see shit that you want to get that you cannot afford. You may see stuff for $5 dollars that you don't have $5 in your pocket to spare for that. I'm not saying that you don't have $5 in your pocket, but I'm saying not to spare on that. See, that's the thing. You know, that's why I like to see people, you know, pick up stuff, be happy, you know, because, you know, just because it ain't my time at that particular time, but it's your time. And I'm happy to see you enjoy it. See, that's what being a member of community is about, the camaraderie, people being happy, rooting you on, telling you, man, you got this. Man, your collection looking good, man. You got this right. Man, whether if it's dusty or not, shit, not everybody going to be here with forced air 
I used to have can air blowing stuff and toys falling, man. I'm like, oh, did I had dusters, man? I had all type of shit, man. I was like, I'm tired. You know, I'm enjoying the collection, man. You know what? I can't move every toy around every particular time. You may see particular things missing. Like you may see uh, things moved around over here. I have to move it around, man. I like how things, you know, work in different places. It may not work over here, but it may work over here. You know, like I told you, I might do Fortnite on this shelf. I don't know what's going on, man. You know, I might put the Fortnite dinosaurs with G.I. Joe, man. I don't know. I, I just know I like the way how stuff is coming about. I like the way how, you know, um, these uh, companies are coming together. Places like Ollie's, you know, again, a lot of people call this a graveyard, but it's not. These are things that make collectors happy, and we should be happy to be just part of the community at this point. You know, happy to see deals that we haven't seen, you know, prices that we haven't seen since our childhoods. You know, a lot of us were, you know, 80s babies, 90s babies, you know, grew up in those times. Some of us 2000, but you know, in those particular points and times, and you know, you looking at everything, you can understand what is what. This is why I say be happy and enjoy what the hell you got. But to later, fam, thank you for watching. Peace out.